an initiative for cross fertilizer of ideas, share experiences and challenges in broadcasting is the vision of Nasrallah Broadcasting Service Management in organizing the annual lecture. It's the second edition and Governor Abdullah Isle is among the guests at the lecture series where he unveils government plan to equip the state and train staff to be more professional in information dissemination. As members of the fourth estate of the rim, the media, Governor Sule says, must not be objectives devoid of ethnic or religious sentiment while discharging their duties. He assures management of the organization that his administration is working on upgrading studios facilities in both Lafayette and Kefi, as well as other equipment to boost transmission of the station. This is the world of digitization to which Nigeria and the rest of Africa has no other excuse but to enter. Which is why for a broadcaster to navigate this new world of information chatter where our TV and radio audiences are constantly bombarded by countless competing messages. You need knowledge, you need skill, and sound education. Vice Chancellor of Federal University Kashiri, Gombe State, Professor Umaru Party, identifies poor funding, obsolete equipment, and fake news, among others, as some of the challenges confronting media organizations in the country. He therefore calls on state government to increase funding for MBS and digitalize its operations. The competition for people's attention is massive, so for MBS to be relevant, it must be part of the information superhighway. State Commissioner for Information, Abdullah Angbolo, urges media practitioners in the state to be objective in their reportage as he assures government support. Executive Vice Chairman, Nasra Broadcasting Service, Awalu Salu, pledges the commitment of NBS to live above board in discharging its responsibilities of informing, educating, and entertaining the public. Indeed, as part of his desire to help the MBS transit to a digital broadcasting station of global standards, Governor Sule has approved the total upgrade of the station, a project that is at an advanced stage of implementation. The unveiling of MBS monograph by Governor Abdullah Yusuli climaxed the event. In Lafia, Aliu Tijani, NT News.